the Public Service Commission has, in exercise of the power vested in it by Section 89 of the Constitution, appointed Mr. D.M. as Financial Secretary with effect from 9th October 2013. His appointment was on a contractual basis for an initial period of two years. The salaries and benefits he has drawn since 9th October 2013 were totally in compliance with those prescribed by the Pay Research Bureau for the post of Financial Secretary and are same as the terms and conditions and benefits applicable for senior officials in the public service. In December 2014, when this government took office, Mr. Diem was kept in his post as Financial Secretary on the same terms and conditions. The contract of appointment was then renewed by the Public Service Commission for a further period of two years with effect from 9th October 2015 and September 2017 on the same terms and conditions as for the initial contract and including an additional responsibility allowance of 40,000 rupees. These terms and conditions of appointment were revised in compliance with the PRB report of 2016. His basic salary is now 164,000 rupees. As regards part A2 of the question, in accordance with the Ministry of Civil Service and Administrative Reforms Circular Letter date number 57 of 2013, the Financial Secretary has been provided with a car, namely an Audi A6. As regards part B of the question, the information is being tabled. Yes, uh, Madam Speaker, can I ask the Honorable Prime Minister if uh, he has information in relation at least for the FSC, for the FSC whereby Mr. Madraj sits there as a financial secretary. Is this also, uh, uh, as a chairman, sorry, rather, do you have this information? This question is not related to this substantive question. Yes. Um, Since the Prime Minister is not ready to answer all the questions that I'm asking, I have no further supplementary. Madam Speaker, Madam Speaker, uh, let me reply. Uh, I, I did not say... Please, order, order. He said that he didn't have any question. So, you said, Honorable Prime Minister, you, you said that this, the question that he's requested doesn't form part of the main question. So I understand that he should have come with another question, and if he comes with another question, you are going to reply. Is that so? He has made, the, the member has made an allegation uh, towards me, saying that I am, not, I am not willing to reply. Please, please. Robert Berrande, please, allow the Prime Minister to make his point. Allow, allow, the Prime Minister, allow the Prime Minister to make his point. If he has, if he has, he has a point of order to raise, allow him to raise. It's not for you. Order, please. Yes, Honorable Prime Minister, if you have a point of to, order, you raise your point of order. I want to react to what the, the Honorable Member is saying as a legation. I, I am ready to reply. I am ready to reply, Madam Speaker, provided. Honorable Prime Minister, order, please. Honorable Prime Minister, Honorable Prime Minister, please, if you have the point of order, you raise your point of order to say that I'm ready to reply, provided the right questions are being asked. Order, please. Order. Honorable Lutim. Honorable Balumudi. 
Honorable Balumudi, please. I have already given the floor to Honorable Osman Mahomed. Thank you. Uh, with regards to Pass B, will the Honorable Prime Minister indicate to the House whether he has approved, I'm sure he will recall, any mission, any mission for the Financial Secretary to deal with the, to go to Kenya, to deal with the Britam case for which there is a strong perception of conflict of interest because he has appointed himself, uh, Mr. Lakshmi Pasad, PS, to deal with that file. Has, has Mr. Dave Mazras traveled on behalf of the Ministry of Finance to Kenya to deal with the Britam case? This is my question. Well, let me look at the list of uh, uh, missions. I see that in two, in two five. <laughs> It's the last time I'm calling you to order. Honorable Balumudi and Honorable Amiamia. It's the last time that I am calling you to order. Honorable Amiamia, I have said it's the last time I'm calling you to order. Right. Honorable Beranger, Toto, please stop making remarks from a sitting position. Allow the Honorable Prime Minister to reply. Yes. I think, I think this member does not listen properly. I said I am going, I'm tabling this uh, list of missions. Hey, vous n'aurez pas bon. I'll faire soigner. Can we have some order, please? And allow the Honorable Prime Minister to reply. Well, you need any anti-expert to unblock this. Honorable Bagwan, Honorable Bagwan, please hold on this side and do not provoke. Let me deal with this side. Honorable Bagwan, Honorable Bagwan, last time I'm calling, I am calling you to order last time. Please sit down. 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 Sit down. No, will you sit down when I am on my feet? Will you sit down when I am on my feet? Right? I have said. Now, are you arguing with me, Honorable Bhagwan? Are you arguing with me? You are arguing with me? Then withdraw what you've just said. Otherwise, I'm not prepared to accept. No, I am not prepared. Sit down. Please sit down. Please sit down. I am. Honorable Bagwan. Honorable Bagwan. Unless, unless you withdraw those words that you just said. Okay? Then you are, not, are you prepared to withdraw these words? I give you a chance to withdraw these words that you just said that I am protecting, and this is very outrageous. If you say, Honorable Bagwan, no, I can't accept this. Honorable Bagwan, I won't accept this. Honorable Bagwan, then, then, Honorable Bagwan, I don't have any. I have tried my best, Honorable Prime Minister, Honorable Bagwan, I have never protected anyone, and if you, I have no other alternative. I have tried my best to keep you in this house, but what you have said, then, Honorable Bagwan, I have no alternative. I am asking you to withdraw from the house. Unless you are unless you are prepared unless you are prepared 
to withdraw your words. I give you one more chance. Honorable Bagwan, one last chance. Then I, I order you out, Honorable Bagwan. I'll order you out. I order you out. I order you out. And this, okay? Last time I suspend the city and I'll come back.